zero target has also changed. Uh, it, it's no longer an eight and a half by 11 sheet of paper with a 300 meter graphic representation. Uh, it is now a bullseye target. The boxes on the zero target now have changed in size and value. On the previous zero target, there were centimeter boxes. These boxes are now called minute of angle size boxes. Minute of angle is basically a, a measurement of angle at distance at 100 meters. It's roughly about one inch. Um, at 200 meters, two inches, 300 meters, three inches, and so on. At 25 meters, these boxes correspond to the clicks left or right for windage or up and down for elevation on your rifle. What's really nice about this target is that in the bottom on your marginal information, uh, in column A, it tells you uh, what weapon system you have, or if you have an M4, uh, it'll tell you what corresponding adjustments move at how many boxes on the target. So for example, uh, M4, with backup iron sights. For every click, left or right, on the windage knob at the rear of the rifle, it will move the impact of the rounds 0.75 boxes left or right. That's 75% of one of these boxes. For elevation, utilizing the front sight post, every click or every notch that's moved, every notch that's moved either up or down will impact the rounds either up or down a full box and 75% of the next box. So if you go through the procedures, you'll have three of these targets set up on a target backer. Once the range is cleared hot to fire, the OIC or NCOIC of the range will give the soldiers command to lock and load one five round magazine and commence firing. They'll fire five rounds on target A. That grouping of five rounds, uh, Army has decided that the previous groupings of three rounds was not an accurate measurement on how to triangulate a grouping. Um, it just wasn't enough rounds. So sometimes soldiers would have two good shots and maybe one was a little bit out of that peripheral, uh, that periphery of, of their grouping. But was it a one good shot and two bad ones or two good ones and one bad one? So uh, the Army said that a, a good measurement is a grouping of five. Those five rounds, four out of five of them have to be in a circle no more than six boxes wide. Okay, the, the allowable tolerance is six minute of angle or a six box width in diameter. So a soldier will fire those five rounds. We'll all go back, make no adjustments. Soldiers will lock and load another five round magazine. They'll get another command to fire and they'll fire their second grouping of five rounds. That grouping of 10 should theoretically be all in the same place. If that is the case, then, then we encourage soldiers to draw a circle around that aggregate of 10, draw an X on it, so they can see what the center of that group is, basically the average, and then count the number of boxes, either left or right or up or down to get where they need to be for center. Once those soldiers have fired those 10 rounds on the first target, they'll start making those adjustments based on the formulas at the bottom, then start shooting target B, which will be the bottom left target on the target stand in five round strings. Five rounds, make more adjustments, fire the second five, make more adjustments, and then on target C, they'll fire the last five and five. 